Hello everyone, my name is Charity and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I have a modesty video for you. How many times ladies have you gone to the store, found a really nice top or a dress and then this happened? So as you can see here, we have a very deep neck. And so what do we do about that? You know, how do we really solve this problem? So over the years, I've grown to appreciate my neckline to be at my collarbone or above my collarbone. And I have just found that it just makes me feel really comfortable. So here's our solution. Here we have some just plain tank tops that I actually picked up from Walmart. And this is the same tank top, but in different colors. I actually have it in a few other colors as well. So tip number one is definitely buy tank tops and buy them in different colors. Most of the time you notice that the front part of the tank top is the lowest. And so one tip that you can do is to wear your tank tops backwards as you have seen. And I do this quite often. Another tip is that you may want to go a size down. And so I typically wear a size small, but when it comes to um, inserts for my low cut tops, which I call them inserts, I always will go, well, sometimes depending on the fabric, I will go just a size down to an extra small, just so that it gives me that full coverage. So certain tank tops do come with tags. These tank tops in particular actually don't have tags on them. As you can see there, the design, what would have been on the tag is actually on the tank top itself. And so um, if there's a tag, you can just clip it off with a pair of scissors. Sometimes I've actually worn it with the tag on, but if the tag is a concern, you can definitely clip, clip it off. That's not a problem. So another tip is that when you're actually shopping, you wanna just be on the lookout for, you know, inserts or like sleeveless tops that are, that do have a good neckline. Like for instance, this one has a really good neckline. I purchased this from JCPenney online and I have this in two other colors as well. Another th tip also is that if you do find an insert that has a pretty good neckline, definitely go ahead and purchase multiple colors because that will help you in the long run. So this is a really unique insert. I love this. This is something that I would typically wear underneath a blazer, as you can see. And the neckline is perfect. I've had this insert for many, many, many years. It was purchased from JCPenney and it's still in really, really good shape. And um, now remember when I talked about how sometimes you can wear your inserts or tank tops backwards. So this particular one just doesn't qualify for that. As you can see, there's a hole in the back and then there's also some buttons. And so just, you know, when you're shopping for stuff like this, you need to know like, you know, what you can wear backwards and what you cannot wear backwards. Wanted to show you how I um, used the one of the inserts that I've shown you, AKA tank top <laughs> in one of my tops. So this top I purchased from Kohl's and as you can see, there's no there are no buttons or a zipper in the front. And so I'm gonna need some coverage there. So I went ahead and I wore this tank top backwards. Another thing to keep in mind is the fabric of the insert. So this one actually has spandex in it. And as you can see there, when you lift it, it does, it, it sort of snaps back onto the skin. And so I always like to um, purchase, you know, inserts with um, a certain percentage of spandex in it so that it really sticks to my skin. And the reason for this is that if you are to bend over for whatever reason, you don't want to be exposed. And so either going a size down or purchasing a an insert that has a certain amount of spandex in it will really um, ensure that it sticks to your body so that if you were to bend over or do whatever, that you're not going to be unnecessarily exposed. All right, you all, thank you so much for watching and I hope to bring you some more modesty content. Alrighty, subscribe for more of videos like this. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.